guys this is Jolt in today's video we are going to do some more fun again for many many months I was wondering if I can use a normal human shampoo I mean not made of humans obviously made for humans shampoo to wash the car with because it's free of everything it it says it's colorant free paraben free silicone free it should be pH neutral I mean it is because I tested so if it is not harmful for us humans how could it be harmful for a car but in case i'm wrong leave a comment let me know um, and then we can discuss because i'm really wondering if it would work um, yeah it's for all kind of hard hair types so i suppose it would remove like grease and whatever but anyway i put 100 milliliters in the foamer and I put a squirt in the bucket. So now just for the sake of fun, I want to see how much foam it's going to produce, how good is it going to be as a cleaner, just when I rinse it off, and then how is it working with the wash mitt. So let's go ahead. Okay, well, first conclusion is that it's not foaming as much as a dedicated car shampoo. Uh, even though I use the 100 ml in hot water. However, the smell is magnificent, I'm telling you. It's, I could smell all these herbs and whatever, just like when I take a shower and I use the shampoo for my hair. So it's, it's beautiful. How much dirt is going to remove, we will see in a mo when I'm going to rinse it off. Um, but yeah, of course, it, it wasn't intended for cars and uh, also it wouldn't be a good value for money to clean cars with it even if it worked. But let's see. I'm just going to wait a little bit to see how much dirt it could remove. Um, what I can tell you so far is that I'm not sure if it left some sort of layer on the top of the surfaces, some residue, or it started to attack this all kind of ceramic coating and uh, protection on it. But the water is definitely not as hydrophobic, or the surfaces are definitely not as hydrophobic as before. Um, yep, I'm going to have a look after using the wash mitt and then rinse it off and then dry it again. I mean, I dry it and then I will spray it on the, let's say, on the hood or bonnet just to see if it is still going to be the case. Bye. 
Okay, so now after I washed, what is my next conclusion? The smell of it was marvelous. I'm telling you, all these herbs I could smell whilst I was washing. It's, I think all kind of shampoos should have a smell like this or some sort of nice fruit. But anyway, um, I mean car shampoos. Then the next one. It was lubricating the surface like crazy. It was foaming okay from the bucket, from the foamer, it was not so okay. But again, don't forget, it's a normal shampoo, it's not a car shampoo, it should, I shouldn't even use it for this purpose. But all in all, it cleaned off the dirt with the touch wash or contact wash uh, with the wash mitt, so I can't really complain. I think for my previous question, the answer would be that it left some residue on the surface, not attacked the protection. But let's have a look at it now because I dried. So now I'm just going to mess a bit with the um, bonnet, with the hood, just to see if there is any hydrophobic effect left. Heck knows, it's like 50-50. I'm going to quickly wash the hood with ONR and we'll see what's happening.
before we go any further, I just need to mention that it's not a sponsored video, it's uh, not a paid advert. I just happened to grab this pharmacy shampoo that was the nearest to my hand uh, when I was thinking about which one to try with. However, in case you are from Poland and Slovakia, I'm going to leave a link below the video where you can buy uh, pharmacy products um, with a 23% discount. And maybe even if you are from the Czech Republic, but that's something I need to check. So anyway, um, if you feel like getting any of these products with some discount, link will be in the description. Let's continue. Okay, we've got the answer. It was definitely something to do with um, leftover residue because after the ONR wash, it, it is hydrophobic again. So, but again, it, it was not intended to wash a car. However, if you are really keen on washing your car on a Sunday night, in the middle of the night, you have nothing else at home, you can't go anywhere to buy some sort of car shampoo, then it's better than nothing, but it, it's really not for this purpose. So again, it was only a joke. But word. Anyway, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. And also press the notification bell so you're not going to miss any of my upcoming videos. I would like to say a big thank you for your time and wishing you a nice rest of the day. Bye bye.